one of my favorite stories of someone saving for something special in, in all my years of working at banking was I had a, a, a little girl come in and I asked her what she was saving for. She was opening her very first savings account and she said, I'm saving up to buy a goat. <laughs> and so um, she, she did save enough money and she eventually got herself a goat. Wow. Um, she brought in pictures to show me and then I think she ended up getting another goat too. So, you know, <laughs> we all have those special things sure. we want to save for. Hello and welcome to the Best Life Podcast, where we here at Ultra Federal Credit Union are helping you live your best life. I'm your host, Tony Beyer. Thank you so much for tuning in. And we'd also like to welcome in our uh, audience joining us via video for this podcast as well. So we ended last year with a podcast talking about how we can make our 2022 even better by making a spending plan and also coming up with strategies to save money. And I can't think of a better way to end this year Then with a podcast talking about how to make your deposits grow. I mean, who doesn't want that? Who doesn't want more money? Uh, So to better make sense of all everything going on with interest rates, I'd like to welcome back to the podcast, Jennifer Seert. She is our VP of Deposit and Payment Strategies. Welcome back to the podcast, Jennifer. Thank you, Tony. It's great to be here with you today. Very good. So I wanted to ask you, what is going on with interest rates? Uh, And if you uh, could tell us a little bit about where where they've been and where they're going. Yeah, well, you know, Tony, you'd have to be hiding under a rock to not know that there's been, you know, a lot of interesting things going on with, with deposit rates lately. And well, you know, certainly we hear a lot about mortgage rates and auto loan rates, you know, and how those have really climbed in the last two years. But you might not have heard a lot about deposit rates, so I'm, I'm glad that I get to be here to talk with you about that today. Absolutely, and uh, and and the good news is that they are rising, correct? Yes, they are rising. Absolutely. So I know that we hear quite a bit about uh, our interest rates. We get a lot of, um, you know, emails, communication, everything like that. But not everybody probably knows what's going on with deposit rates. So if you could tell us a little bit more about that, that'd be great, Jennifer. Yeah, you know, I'd be happy to. And 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 now is a really great time to take a look at what your deposit accounts are, are earning. So, you know, when you get your quarterly statements, those will be coming out here towards the end of the year. You'll probably get them early January. Take a look at your quarterly statements. Take a look at your monthly statements. You always should anyways, right? But take a look and see what they're earning. You might be surprised to see Um, that some of your savings accounts aren't earning as high of a rate, especially if they're with another institution. And we'd love to help you out with that. Absolutely. And this time of year, uh, getting towards the end of the year, it's always a great idea to do a money checkup and get yourself in a better position, you know, for the next year. Uh, So talking about uh, those savings rates, what about, uh, you know, what's going on day to day um, in some of our accounts uh, here at Ultra? What's going on with those rates? Yeah, you know, day to day, that money that you use every day, you know, in your checking account when you're out getting groceries, buying gas and that sort of thing. That's your day to day money. And you might as well make that work as hard for you as you can. Right. So I love our A plus checking accounts. Those earn a really great rate. You can earn 1.75 or 2.75, depending awesome. on how you use your account. Um, and those are a great, you know, tool to be able to to make the most of your day to day money. Absolutely, and uh, I love my yeah A plus uh, checking. You know, getting the the you know the interest rate there, and then also being able to use it on my you know my phone, um, being able to use tap to pay with my cards, with my you know mobile wallet, things like that. So it makes it incredibly easy. Uh, in order to uh, to access my money uh, as well here at Ultra. Great. That's great to hear, Tony. I know I was just at the grocery store and I used my phone to pay. And it, it was nice because, you know, it's already in your hand. Why right. not just use it to, to yep. pay for, for your items as, as you head out? It's super duper easy um, as well. Um, so what about money um, that I'm putting into savings? What's going on uh, with those deposit rates? Sure. Well, you know, first of all, we always encourage everyone to, to have an emergency fund built up. You know, and so we have a special savings product so you can save for anything special that you want, whether that be your emergency fund to cover, you know, un, you know, unknown or unexpected expenses or to save for something special coming up. So those are a great place to put some money just to make sure that you have it in case an emergency comes up and you, and you should need to spend some money. Absolutely. And that should be an account that you can access very, very easily um, as well, which you could do with re- really any of our, you know, savings products and things like that for the most part. So. Um, Also, um, if you're able to tell us uh, a little bit more, um, you know, that emergency fund again, um, six to 12 months, we've talked about, you know, having those living expenses, you just never know what's going to happen. And I like to say with, uh, with your health, with your career, your living situation, those you depend on, those that depend on you, transportation, appliances, all those things, you just never know what's going to happen. So having that money in savings. So uh, once I have money in my savings account, 
Um, and it, it's grown to a, a good balance. I've got that emergency fund. Uh, you know, what else could I do with my money, uh, perhaps, to make it grow a little bit more? Sure. You know, that emergency fund is so important. Um, one of my favorite stories of someone saving for something special in, in all my years of working at banking was I had a, a, a little girl come in and I asked her what she was saving for. She was opening her very first savings account and she said, I'm saving up to buy a goat. <laughs> and so um, she she did save enough money and she eventually got herself a goat. Wow. Um, she brought in pictures to show me and then I think she ended up getting another goat too. So, you know, <laughs> we all have those special things sure. we want to save for. So make sure that you have that money set aside, not just for emergencies, but for those purchases that you want to make and have goals for. Excellent. Um, yeah, and then after you get a little bit more money saved up, then it's time to start saying, you know, how can I make this money grow a little bit harder for me? And do you know what the hardest thing about saving money is, Tony? What's that? Just getting started. Yeah. Just getting started. So here at right. Ultra, we try to make it easy for you. You can open up a savings account online, right, within online banking, or you can stop in and see any of our, our financial service representatives at the branches, and they'll help you get started. It's really very easy. Once, once you get that account open, you'll find that you enjoy saving money almost as much as you enjoy spending money. Absolutely. And when you have money saved up, I mean, not only for emergencies, but also those opportunities, you are able to take advantage of those and that could lead to a go to, you know, who knows uh, with those. And then as far as your money being protected, um, what kind of insurance or, or what kind of things do we have here at Ultra? Yes, your, your money here is protected by NCUA insurance. So you know that your deposits that you have, whether they be in your savings account or a money market savings account, um, or even a certificate of deposit, those are all going to be insured deposits, which are very safe. Excellent. Very good. So that's all the questions that I have for you, but it's really encouraging news that, you know, deposit rates, uh, that those are going up. It's going to put more people or more money in people's pockets uh, as well. Is there is there anything else that I haven't talked about or any questions that I haven't asked, Jennifer? Yeah, you know, I wanted to just talk about our certificate specials yeah. because that's a really... Um, popular account that we have right now. And I looked back and two years ago, we were paying 0.70% annual percentage yield on our 13 month Thrive certificate, which is very popular. And right now that's paying 3.8% oh, wow. annual percentage yield. So that's just what a difference two years can make, no, right? Sure. A lot has happened over the last two years. So you can take, you know, as little as $1,000, put that into savings, and that earns a great um, dividend for you to be able to help your money grow faster. Very and again, good. that can also be opened online or, or in our branches too. Excellent. Yep. And you can get more information on our website at ultra.org, or you can stop in any of our offices and uh, talk to some of the, the friendly employees that we have here at Ultra Federal Credit Union. So I really appreciate you taking the time. I know you're incredibly busy, uh, Jennifer. Never um, too busy for you, Tony. <laughs> oh, thank you. Uh, and again, we're speaking with uh, Ultra Federal Credit Union's VP of uh, Deposit and Payment Strategies, Jennifer Seert. Thank you so much for, for being on the podcast. It's my pleasure. Well, that's going to do it for this episode of the Best Life Podcast presented by Ultra Federal Credit Union. If you have a, a topic or something that you'd like us to cover, you, let us know. Uh, send me an email at tjbuyer at ultra.org. And who knows, it may make it into a future episode. Don't forget to follow the Best Life Podcast wherever you get your podcasts, or you could find it at ultra.org. So as always, thanks again, be well, and we'll talk to you again soon. I just threw in that whole part about the goat, but it is my favorite savings story. So if you want me to do it over again without the goat, I totally will. I loved it. I loved the goat. I wanted to make a Tom Brady joke. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, I was just like, Tom Brady, but uh, yeah, awesome. Not.